Okay, so let's move on. So to further assist speeding up the planning and processes and to find the right tool for your job, we're now going to look briefly at what uh, Walter's guided product search is or GPS as uh, Ian just said, and as most of you know it. With more than 900 customers and 15,000 users, TDM Systems, part of the Sandvik Group, is the leading software manufacturer for managing tool data across different sectors worldwide. With Industry 4.0, the requirements are growing for increasingly shorter project runtimes, maximum process reliability in production, and more productivity. TDM Systems is meeting these challenges with intelligent software solutions for tool management. TDM Tool Lifecycle Management ensures optimum communication between the planning and manufacturing levels. The TDM Base Module, GlobalLine, forms the foundation for tool management. With a large number of integrations and easy operation, TDM GlobalLine helps with process planning, enables you to control production orders, plan the required production resources, and to control and supervise manufacturing facilities. With software solutions from TDM Systems, you can minimize your tooling and manufacturing costs. From design through to manufacturing on the machine, you create transparent and effective inventory management, reduce the variety of tool types, and achieve maximum efficiency when selecting tools. With optimum tool use, optimum tool logistics, and accurate tool data, you reduce your tooling costs by 20%, and reduce your machine downtimes by 30%. Whether you have manufacturing facilities all over the world at various locations or operate locally, with the fully integrated software for tool management from TDM Systems, you can rely on efficient processes and maximum productivity right from the start. TDM Systems, your experts for maximum productivity. You're looking for the right tooling solution regarding your turning operation? The machining navigation Walter GPS supports you finding it. From the drawing to the machining operation. Start Walter GPS online on the Walter homepage at walter-tools.com. The application-related search guides you to the tool recommendation. Simply enter the material you want to machine. Select the appropriate turning operation and enter the required machining parameters. Here for a roughing operation. Walter GPS recommends economical tooling solutions and cutting data for your application. Walter GPS provides you with solutions for finishing operations with defined surface qualities. Receive recommendations for tooling solutions and cutting data for grooving operations on your component. Use the tool-related search to perform further operations with an existing water tool. Simply enter the tool designation in the search field. Walter GPS finds your tool and supports you in selecting the right insert. Further to the application. Via material selection 
and parameters. You'll receive the recommended cutting data with just a few clicks. Walter GPS – easy operation as well as fast tool and cutting data recommendation guarantee economical machining solutions for your application. Um, it, to me, in my head, you, you, you use the two in tandem, potentially, the, uh, the GPS, uh, in, in, yeah, the, well, the GPS and the TDM systems. Is that, is that what you see happening? Yeah, to, to start with TDM, Joe, uh, TDM Tool Data Management System, it's a, it's a one-stop um, place to store all of your tool data. We've talked about the, the, the data that could come from Minitime. We, um, we, sp we speak about the part numbers, the, the lengths of certain drills, geometries. It's a perfect place to start storing the data for in TDM. Within TDM you can then um, generate your tool assemblies, you can create kits and, and tool lists and then we can uh, take that off to the machine tool. So support that is where the GPS comes in. Uh, I think a lot of people who are probably watching today, certainly us guys, we're pretty familiar with using GPS to get a, the right tool for the, the solution that is, is required. That information can be transferred through to TDM and the, the previous uh, subject we were talking about, the, the CAD CAM system through the um, manufacturing data management function, if that's available with customers CAD CAM systems. So it's almost, it's almost like a, a cradle to grave, isn't it? It's a scenario where, where you're getting involved right in the early stage, maybe even the quoting process, all the way through to um, get, getting it into place and even tool management. Exactly that, yeah, and, and Anna's going to talk about tool management a bit, bit, bit later on. But um, most, most customers who, who are watching today, and we've had the comments already regarding dinner time, um, have probably used GPS. Once they've gotten that information from the tool, 9 times out of 10, they may take that tool and apply it to the machine, and sometimes the data might be lost. So the next time they need to generate a, a 10 mil hole, they may end up buying a new tool. TDM will it help them store that information and store and be able to access it quickly, so it stops repetition of purchased tools as well. Yeah, and th this data, what can you do with it? Presumably, you could export it to uh, uh, other softwares or maybe to PDFs to send tooling companies and things. Yeah, yeah, the the data that can be generated from TDM uh, can be exported to PDFs for issue to shop floor. Should tool uh, uh, presetting areas need to build up tools. That's perfect. With regards to GPS, we can PDF the report that comes up to indicate the speeds and feeds, the potential tool life available, and we can put that in a PDF report and distribute that to the customer so they've got the complete package for applying the tool correctly. Yeah, absolutely. So, so if you're watching this live, you know, get your questions in. Uh, you, whether you're watching this on LinkedIn, on Twitter, on Facebook, on YouTube, please do uh, get, you, uh, get your questions in whilst the experts are live. But, Software, it's becoming, it's becoming fundamental for cutting tool manufacturers, aren't they? You know, it's probably gone are the days where you could just sell an end mill. It has. Um, the Walter Tool Company, um, established in 1919, was producing cutting tools and has done for many, many years and still will do. Um, but we've evolved from that now. We've gone to the, we've, we've gone to the stage of process uh, evaluation and we're now going into the digitization stage with Industry 4.0. TDM, GPS, in a time, all fit within that window. And what, what is the, the, you know, what's the global idea? Is it to uh, reduce skill level? Is it to increase time? Uh, sorry, reduce time, increase productivity? Uh, what is, what is the, the fundamental idea of all these uh, SaaS products, software products? The, 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 the global idea is, is not to, to dumb down the, the metal cutting industry. It's to improve that knowledge, uh, improve the skill level. Um, every spindle that runs in, in the world needs to be producing parts to put on the shop on the floor to go to the end users. Mm -hmm. You know, we, we, t we constantly talk about backlogs within machine shops. If we can make uh, components more e efficiently, it all helps with the costs going forward. Sure. We just had a question in from James. Okay. Have you, have you got any case studies on this? Uh, you know, have you got any any proven ROIs on these um, types of uh, solutions? On T on on the CDM system. Yeah. Or? Yeah. Sorry. Yeah. Um, we can probably get them direct from Germany. Yeah. If James was it James? Sorry. Yeah. If James wants to get in contact with either Dean or myself um, through the email address that's running along the bottom of the screen, then we can help with him um, try and try and find them. That's good. So. 
again, it's just continually evolving. Presumably, if, if Walter are back in the studio this time next year, we'll be having a similar conversation, but this software would have got better and better and better. Yeah, that's that's the aim, Joe. It's, um, it's a case of what we've got today, we can't stand still, because if we stand still, somebody's going to catch us up, and then they become the, the, the number one. It's always difficult when you're number one, you've got to try and stay number one. So. Ian, um, I've got a question actually myself, just from what you're talking about. You know, we go out and about to different machine shops, different sh sizes. Um, you know, Industry 4.0 and all of this software and the investment in it, what sizes of machine shops are you looking at? You know, are you looking at the bigger companies or are you talking, you know, uh, is a small job shop going to be able to afford this type of technology? Do they need this type of technology? What are your thoughts on that? My, my thoughts on that, Lindsay, are it does apply to uh, the mass manufacturing, but it also applies to the smaller manufacturing. Everybody needs to make um, efficiencies within within the, the jobs that they do. Everybody needs to become comp more and more competitive mm. because we're all competing with one another. Um, it, whatever we talk about today applies to the the subcontractors right the way through to the um, OEMs. Yeah, so it, it really is. You're basically saying the key to survival, essentially, mm. is what you're saying. The key to survival is having to use Industry mm. 4.0, having to use this type of technology to keep up to date, to keep price conscious with your competition. If not, there is potential for you to fall in a, the wrong direction. Yeah, become uncompetitive. Yeah. You, you almost go from being a, a supplier to a partner, don't you? you know, if you get in early enough into a business, you, you, you grow with that business? Yep, exactly that. We, we're working partnership. We, um, we're the side of the partnership that know the cutting tools and how to apply them. The customer will know their materials, they'll know their processes, they'll know their applications. Mm -hmm. And that's a perfect partnership to, to, to better things. Yeah, 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 for sure. I and guess it kind of, for me hearing that, it kind of seems like the further starting block of, of what's to come um, in the future as well. Now, we have had a question come in. Uh, this isn't direct from what the conversation you've just had, had, but do you have salespeople in India? This is from Suresh from Carl Zeiss in India. Uh, yes, we do have salespeople in India. Uh, again, if you can get in contact with us, we can find out the, the, the people who you need to contact directly and then hopefully, hopefully have these discussions with them people as well. And also Marco says hello on LinkedIn. So a big wave to you, Marco. Thanks for watching. And anybody else who's watching us, thank you so much. Um, again, as I've said, um, this is a chance and a moment for you to get all of those questions regarding tooling, uh, regarding what, who Walter are, who are Walter, what do they do? Send them in uh, to us on any social media platform that you're watching us, YouTube, LinkedIn, Facebook, um, anywhere that you are watching us, um, send them in. And you can also hashtag Walter Life UK and, and we'll get those on Twitter and ask um, the industry experts uh, your questions.